Hello everybody, Rusted Ground here. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. It is currently nighttime and I am heading towards the mayor's house because um, we have to visit him at night. Since we did that deed for him in the last episode, I, uh, I just roamed around a little bit around Saint Denis. I hunted some alligators and I found some guys that were trying to blow up a... Um, safe so <clears throat> i helped them out a little bit by you know killing them and grabbing the money basically because i you know i didn't want them to be in danger with uh with the law so i just disposed of them and yeah anyway uh, we're, we're here at the mayor's house let's see what he has to say after this we're most likely going to go back to camp where uh I'm hoping there will be some sort of a conversation with Dutch because the last mission that we did together was, yeah, it went the way it went. Oh, Arthur, it's you. Come in. Where's what's his name? Jean-Marc, he's a little histrionic. I'm worried that he's going to open his mouth and say things that aren't true to those oh, vulgar Puritans crap. at the newspaper. Well, this is bad. Perhaps okay. true, but not the whole truth. Uh, <laughs> yeah, because he didn't agree Look with you. Look at these beautiful books. This is magnificent. We'll bring this city back to life if it kills me. And it probably shall. Yes. Ah, I have two copies of this book. This is an old field guide. Might be of some interest to you. Maybe not. But please have it. Hmm. It's worth quite a bit. Thank you. Okay. My pleasure. Thank you. Listen, Mr. Arthur. I'm sorry to ask this of you. You've done so much. But... But what? Jean-Marc. I'm afraid he's going to open his mouth and say things. How do you mean? Uh, saying nasty things about the work that we have done together, for example. Is that my business? Oh, no. No. <laughs> of course sure. not. He also found out some unsettling news about you. It's all scurrilous lies, of course. But what, what do sort you of mean? news? Oh. I do not talk about idle gossip. Please, I'm a public servant, and we are friends. He's Where do I us. find him? Well, he does live over on uh, Rue de Zachary. Rue de Zachary. Thank you, Arthur. I don't like this. I mean... Okay, what do we have here? Uh, hold on a second. This is a farm field and falconry by George T. Duval. Highlights include tracking animals, farming, bees, recently deceased animals, and so on, and so gathering bones, and so on and so forth. Okay. Right, I don't like the fact that we have to do all these things, you know, for the mayor, just to keep him off our backs, basically. And I kind of see the bigger picture of what he wants to do. But I do agree with Jean-Marc. Uh, some okay, of the things that girl. he did were very shady and... Yeah. Maybe there was another way to... To deal with with some of those those things. But anyway, let's, let's have a look here. I'm assuming that Jean-Marc will probably know that there is a possibility that we're going to there he is come after him why you want to go and say those awful things about me buddy mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. best not to oh, make man. a big drama of things come on let's go see your boss this is gonna hurt, but it's for the best. We didn't even give him a... Okay. We didn't even give him a chance to speak his mind. Whoops. Whoops. 
Hold on a second. Well, this will be interesting. There we go. Right, so the mayor's house is not far, but... Let's see if we can... Let's see if we can sneak our way through the park here. I don't think we will be able to. Damn it. Let's see now. does it. Whew. Okay. I think we got away with it. Bring him around the back. Okay, around the back. Come on, girl. Bring him around the back. Second. There we go. Can I go behind the horse here? No, I can't. Uh, okay, somehow. Hold on a second here. Can I get inside? Nope, I can't. Right. He said bring him around back, but let me see. Yeah, I think we can go through the front, right? Please tell me we can go through the front here. Okay, there we go. We can follow him. That's good. I don't know what he is expecting to get out of this. I mean... Yeah, I don't know how the mayor is what he wants, and I have a bad feeling that, he, you know, he might want us to dispose of Jean-Marc, which I definitely disagree on, but we'll have to see. Come on. Here. Here. Okay. My brother, my brother, Jean-Marc. Oh, we've been so... Uh, I promised to change. I know. Ah, uh, what a silly, silly misunderstanding. You see, the problem is principles will destroy us all. Sure. Oh, no. As long as oh, you two no. are friends again. Yes. And you say you've changed, so we will run the city like men of honor, like you said. Uh, of course, of course, we oh, no. will strive to improve the city's moral backbone by any He's means available shoot him or to something, us. Isn't Within he? reason, yes. Yes, yes. Within my reason. Because I am the mayor, Jean-Marc. And I will save you from yourself. Because it's better to get something done than nothing at all, like you said. Utterly, utterly corrupted, Lemieux. You've not changed at all. I've been supplanted in your esteem by a wanted murderer. You you shame me. <laughs> oh, crap. No, sir. You shame me with your vain naivete. Oh, how I long for the luxury to have principles such as you. But I must actually do things. I see now. You're, you're uh -oh. lost to reason. Yeah. And I see now that you're a horrible little wretch and a sinner yourself. Your sin is deluded vanity. 
Now, sir, I am afraid that you must kill him. I hey, pay you what? handsomely. And Jean-Marc, I will miss you. I really shall. Oh, no, no, kill. no. It must be so. Please. You're not really going to kill me, are you? No. Oh, but all I did was love too much. Love. My duty. Yeah, but you're running your I'll mouth you out of it. me, buddy. And him. He'll betray you just like he's betrayed me. Lemieux is a foul rat. But I'm a man of my word. Let me live and I'll, I'll... I'll destroy him. And I'll make sure you're left well alone. Come on. Please. Please, come no, on. No, I'm not going to kill him. You want to shoot I'm not going to kill man, him. Would you? I might be a brute. I'm not a paid killer. Exactly. Get out of here. Don't mention me, boy. I am not I killing him word. like that. Hell no. Hell no. I'm thinking I should kill the mayor now, but like, <clears throat> anyway. Uh, let's not get ahead of ourselves, I guess. Right. Is there anything else to do around here? No. Yeah, just, just killing, uh, killing a man like that, unarmed. Uh, he hasn't done anything wrong. You know, that's that just feels wrong. I know we're an outlaw and whatnot, but that just feels wrong to me. Anyways, let's see now. I think, I think it's time to go to camp. Yeah. Let's go to camp. Let's see what's happening in there. Let's meet up with Dutch and the rest of the guys. Let's see what the consequences are from our actions. We'll definitely... We're either gonna have to move or something worse is gonna happen. You better hold it right there. What? <laughs> what the hell? I really don't understand what happened there. Honestly, I, I don't know why we're wanted. What is going on? I don't want to shoot these guys. Unless I have to, of course. Twenty-five dollars. Okay, that was weird, man. How? How? I don't. I don't understand what happened. I mean, nobody saw us with uh, when we kidnapped uh, Jean Marc. So I don't understand. Anyway, it's fine. It's fine. Hold on a second. What else do we have here? What is this? What's this? Rustling? What? Uncle is here. What? What's going on here? Oop. I might have to go. Isaac, get over here. What's going on? Whoa, what is this? Hello. This is a Ne a Sabino. Okay, I don't. It's a new horse here. What's going on? What do you want? Oh, don't be like that. This is a good one. Yeah, it always is with you. Until we start getting shot at. Well, have you ever <laughs> been shot at by a cow? Whose cows? It's drunken rancher what? up at Hill Haven Ranch. He's such a flop okay. that we could take a whole marching band up there and steal, and he still wouldn't wake up. Yeah, and or, he's oh a no. son of a bitch. He said unkind things about me. Mm, no, he ain't all bad then. I, I owe you, <clears throat> after last time. This could be my make good. I don't know. 
I need you. You know those two bastards that buy stolen livestock. Sure, I know them. I don't like them. I'll give you 60% of the take. How many cows? I don't know, small herd, I guess. 20, maybe? That's one of Two cows or something. Come on. <laughs> okay, let's see. Okay, let's mount up. I am. I so mounted. Where's this ranch? It's right in the middle of Scarlet Meadows, just past the road's turn off. Right, okay. Let's see. This should be interesting. So how'd you find out about this think. place? I've been hanging around the saloon and roads a bit. Roads? Right. Yeah, the, the barkeep there gossips like a fishwife. And a couple of times he's mentioned how this rancher's a fall-down drunk these days. Sounds like he don't know his ass from his armpit half the time. <laughs> you sure you ought to be hanging around roads after everything that happened? What do you mean? I mean, that it ain't gonna do your health no good. If they find out you ride with us. Nah, Definitely it's not. Fine. I was never there at the same time as you boys. And they'd never reckon on a distinguished old fella like me. Run him with a bunch of yeah, reprobates. Exactly. That's the word. Oh, just be careful. Yep. How old are you, anyway? Well, let's just say I was born sometime between the fall of 49 and the fall of Rome. <laughs> right. right. My right, second right. wife always used to yeah. describe me as ageless, though. She did leave me for a younger man. Hmm. Well, maybe we should cut you open. Count the rings of whiskey. Now nah, I'm ready for my <laughs> retirement, though. <laughs> Let me tell you. You've been pretty much retired from the moment I met you. Now, I mean the tropics, you know, <laughs> the real deal. What Dutch is talking about. That's well, why I jumped Dutch on is, this opportunity. Uh... The sooner we get enough money to leave, the better. Dancing girls with flowers in their hair, warm sand, cold beer. <laughs> That's how I'm gonna see out my days. Well, I'll believe it when I'm cut up this way. Okay, I'm following you, buddy. You let me know. Okay. All right, let's get up there on foot from here. Don't want the horses clopping around outside the window. Come, let's take a closer look. Sure thing. Slow and steady. I don't know how I feel about this oh, uh, mission Look with the uncle. The hell? Who are these clowns? I don't know. This is the first time I ever seen anyone else here. Let's sneak up closer. What? Where the hell are you going? I think I got a plan. Oh, great. Okay. Hurry Let's see what up. he's trying to do here. I'm doing the best I can. So oh, they're up. trying. They're trying to steal. These guys are trying to steal as well. You said he was a drunkard. You said that we could play the fiddle and we wouldn't wake him. I was talking in a metaphor. Now hurry up. Oh, what's a metaphor? You're a jackass. That's a metaphor. Well, you're a son of a bitch. <laughs> that ain't one. Yeah, now, now get back to looking out. And shut up. Okay. So what are we what, now? what are we doing? I thought you had a plan. God damn it. I ain't so sure now. Christ. I'll take care of him. You hear that? Deal with the nothing. rustlers. Oh, I heard something. Hurry up. How can I hear anything with all your speaking? You are gonna wake him up. Oh, oh. I'm doing the best I can. Okay, this here is a rusty padlock. Hurry up. Do it. You think you could do it faster? Shut up. Shut up. Turn around. Shit. <laughs> Put your hands up in the air. What are you doing, boys? Nothing. You know, mm. we kill rustlers around these parts. Well, now, just wait. I'll give you till the count of five to get the hell out of here. There we go. One. Two. Let's go. Mm hmm. Three, four, yeah, <laughs> come on, <laughs> son of okay. a bitch. All right, I didn't have to kill them, which is great. That was loud. Yeah, we 
Well, we ain't got time. He said he ain't gonna wake up, and we ain't seen him yet. I'll get him out. Right up next to the house to keep him from running off on us. Encourage the cows to leave the pen. Okay, that's... Um... Come on. Let's get him out of here. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where do you think you're going? Come on. Move it, move it. Get out of here. Damn it. <laughs> he knocked himself out. <laughs> okay, that's that's good. Now what? Heard the cows to Clemens Cove. Okay. Let's go. I am not very good at this. That's that's for sure. Okay, let's see. Where the hell is Clemens Cove? Hold on a second, let me just... Clemens Cove... Oh, it's over there. Okay, 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 okay. Right, let's do this. Go! Hmm. They're sort of going the right way. Sort of. Okay. Come on. Easy does it. Okay, 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 okay. They're going, they're going in the right direction now. Am I getting closer? A little bit. Yeah, okay. That's good. That's good. Come on. There we go. All right. Wow. That was... I actually managed to get them... Wow. That's interesting. Come on, get in already. All right. Okay, they're all in. Come on, guys. There's nobody else here. There we go. Close the gates. And time to pay up. Good thing we didn't have to kill anyone. That's. Well, hey I'm, there. I'm glad about that. What you got? Cattle. Well, I can see that. Whose cattle? Yours now, if the price is right. Well, I can give you uh, hmm. 50 bucks. Okay. What? 50 bucks each times uh, 20 cattle. No, no, 50 total. <laughs> this is old Squeer's cattle. He knows me. I'm going to kill these guys. I can't do better than that. I'll have to move them right away. We'll take 200, friend. But I got costs. Mm. 150. 75 and not a dollar more. Wow. One hundred, and I don't shoot you. Yeah, exactly. Menacing. 
five, pay your friend here. Hmm. <sighs> I don't like these guys. Bye now. Be careful out there. This is nasty country. Hey, don't forget to put some in the pot. Oh, of course. <laughs> like I told you, easy. Sure, I guess. I'm headed home. You coming? Nah, I'll see you later. Mm hmm. Thanks for the help with this, Arthur. Okay. Right. Uh, let's get back to camp. Yep. So, yeah. Ooh. Before we do that, however, we're going to make a little trip down to Rhodes Post Office. Pay off our weird bounty. Yeah. That I don't even understand why we got. But let's do that. Okay. And then we can safely go to camp, I hope. Unless anything else happens in the meantime. You never know. I'm very surprised that I managed to get all those cows. Okay, well that's a thing. No, 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 no! Damn it. Damn it. Let me see if I can get a, get away from them for, for a second here. Anybody else? I don't have my weapons, that's the problem. Gonna lose him. Gonna die Damn it! Mm, so annoying. I didn't man, I was trying to I was trying to mount my horse. Damn it, those Lemoyne raiders. I thought I got rid of them. Man. Yeah. Okay. This is this is so annoying. I really need to, to find a way to get, get rid of them once and for all, you know? See here. Yeah, I was trying to mount my horse, and then what happened? Hold on a second. What is this? Okay. And then for some reason, I just I, I couldn't, and and I I also then I panicked, and I, I was pressing the um, eagle eye button to try to shoot them, and then they just got me. It is what it is now. You know? Let's see over here. Man, it's so dark. Pitch black. Over here. Now, let's have a look. Sir. Hello, sir. Back. Hello, hello. Let me pay my bounties, please. Pay, huh? I lost $128 because of these guys. I never did anything right. wrong, but I got falsely accused, you know. Yeah, exactly. You know, that's that's most well, of the times what happens with me. Is. I get that's falsely cool. accused. Okay. Right. Come on. I'm girl. very surprised at how much the money from the um, Come on. The money from the um Valentine bank heist. How long they managed to to last for me? 
it is yeah i'm i'm actually amazed that i still have the money that i have Your currently most of them are most of them are from uh, that that bank heist that's that's awesome and again it's very very dark you can barely see where i'm going whoop lighter now a new day a new dawn let's get to camp whoa all of a sudden the sun came out things are looking up hold on what the hell out of the damn way hey the hell you know what That was weird. I thought he had a like a mask. Anyway, let's go. I think they did a very good job with all those attacks, those surprise attacks by the gangs, because you rarely i mean not really i never i've never expected to be attacked just like that just by it's arthur good to see i was just back, riding along and then all of a sudden something blew up and then my horse just went crazy and yeah i think i think they did a very good job with that very good job all right so we're back at camp here let's let's have a chat with dutch i guess you know Lenny? Hey, Lenny. <sighs> you gonna freeze on, buddy? That I'm gonna freeze. You're in your underwear. What are you talking about? Okay, let's see. I'm telling you, Dutch, this is the way to do this job. The distraction will buy you all the time you need. I don't like it. Oh, what it's are the they right planning plan. now? We've done the work. Jim? Look. The bank. Karen Tilly oh, Abigail no. sent them all. They all say the same thing. There's no more than one armed guard. And the police? It's a city. There are police. But as far as we can tell, the patrols will all be going this way when Abigail and I cause the diversion. That's the opportunity. What do you think, Arthur? I don't see we have a lot of choice. We we're going to rob here. a bank. We know we're dead. But the plan. Another bank? We got a decent bunch. We know how to fight. The city cops don't seem so tough as long as we move Oop. fast. Okay, I so we're robbing the Sandini Bank. In the day with a distraction. If that's what Jose is saying. It's as good a plan as any. I, th I think I agree. When we do it at night, there's the drama of just getting into the bank. Can't do that silently. They'll pick us off far easier. I know. I'm, I'm just making sure. Every plan is a good plan if we execute it properly. Every problem we had was because we did not execute properly even blackwater from my understanding you're right he's very reserved what what's going on here i'm surprised Let's that he is reserved bastard. everyone get some rest we ride out in the morning look smart travel light 